Man, that Toyota's nice. This is like the only Corolla I like, you know, like since I've been alive. You know, we all know my dad owned an SR5 coupe manual in that pretty silver gray color. You know, rear wheel drive Toyota Corolla. And the year was 1985, I think, on that thing. So, of course, we know those are cool cars, but this one I could actually fuck with. Like, if this car just had a. Like, Toyota's mistake was they never put a B16 type engine in a car. If if Toyota had, a, if this was a Toyota Corolla TRD, and it had you know a 1.6 liter high revving Toyota, you know valve deal engine, like to, Toyota never bothered. You know and that's the truth. They never bothered. You know they, they made a Supra for a little bit, and anybody that calls the Celica Supra a Supra needs to be cut and and and, and spat upon. But my point is, Toyota just has no heart. I'm telling you the truth. The reason I like Honda, like guys, I've I've been riding Hondas since, since I was five years old. Like, I, dog, I was into Hondas before you. Is all I'm saying. <laughs> and I knew that the man, he he, Solchiro Honda, he he built engines like he. Um, you know, you cut the aluminum or whatever, and physically made compression chambers, you know, and um, they built a fucking engine. And then he started putting them in motorcycles and racing them. Like, Honda is always about, um, well, there's there's always been that history of motorsport, you know what I'm talking about? And it's even cooler because it started with a bicycle, or a motorcycle, I mean. There's, there's one bit of damage there. The headliner's falling down. So, so, see, things like that, when you're buying a car from somebody, you count everything that's, that's different from factory. And you say, this is, I have to fix this, I have to fix this. And you, and you have to, for example, I would tell them, look, that's going to cost me $200 to fix the, the headliner in this car. And then, in order to get this dent out, that's going to be $600 plus i got to paint it. So, even though I'm lying and I'm making these things up, I just gave $800 worth of example why I want to pay less for your car, you know what I mean? And it's up to you to be like, um, you know, to accept it or not, you know what I mean? That's what happens when you buy something. Two people agree. It's You have to have a meeting of the minds. That's what creates a contract. I mean, these ancients are cool. I mean, look how big this thing is. I had one of these, you know. It was my favorite thing I've ever had. Well, no, it's not. It was a Fiat. See, there's another Corolla. See, this guy put some wheels on it, though. I mean, it it, it doesn't look terrible, but the only people around this part of Florida that, that buy Toyotas and think Toyotas are cool are, are Spanish guys, you know what I mean? Like, Puerto Rican, Dominicans. Um, I don't know what Mexicans drive. I think they drive anything. But no white guy is going to buy a, a Toyota and modify it and stance it, okay? Especially not a Corolla. <laughs> oh, so this is my friend's Honda S2000. So I'm going to look it over like I did that last thing. I'm going to make a new video.